There are many things that Christians shouldn't do. Most of these things are obvious, such as murder, coveting, or stealing. But one area that's not so obvious is how our vocabulary needs to change, and in one area specifically, and that is our usage of profanity, or lack thereof. But now you must also rid yourselves of all such things as these, anger, rage, malice, slander, and filthy language from your lips. Now, that last part of the verse, which is Colossians 3.8, pretty simply sums up this whole profanity issue. We shouldn't use filthy language. Now, it's pretty obvious that profanity is filthy language. And to be blunt, no, you cannot use them simply because they are obscene, immature, and most of all, as Colossians 3 describes, filthy. Now, we shouldn't use these words that are obviously filled with disrespect, anger, and sin. We shouldn't waste our breath uttering these disgraceful words. But how do we know if something is wrong and profane, or if some people are simply just making a big deal out of really nothing? And you could ask yourself this simple question. Could I say this around my pastor? If the answer is yes, then most likely it's perfectly fine. If you couldn't, well then I wouldn't say it anywhere, whether the pastor is present or not. Either way, thank you all for watching. If you liked, leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.